happened down at Cedar Point today for food truck battle. Ohio versus Michigan food truck battle, something like that. You ready for some fun? Yes. So I think, what are we gonna do? We're gonna go back to the gatekeeper first, right? We are gonna check out the line. Yeah, there's usually no line for the gatekeeper. So even though it's food truck, and I'm excited about the food trucks, so I'm not quite ready to eat food truck food yet, right? No, I'm good for now. All right. Actually, before we head to the gatekeeper, I wanna see if they have any Halloween weekend stuff out in the gift shop yet. So yeah, no Halloween weekend stuff, but they do have this cool new Steel Vengeance shirt. Looks like McCree from Overwatch. How much is it, dear? $24.99. $24.99. That's not too bad. Nope. It's hard to tell if there's a lot of people here yet or not. This midway seems kind of crowded, but I think that's where all the food trucks are. The parking lot didn't seem excessively full or anything. Well, yeah. Pretty much no way for the gatekeeper, so this will be fun. Well, did you get sick? Off the gatekeeper? Huh? No, but I probably shouldn't have drank all that water. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right beforehand? Yeah, we downed an entire bottle of water <laughs> before we got on the ride, and there was like no weight. Such a waste. Oh, man, look at that now. We got right on. There's actually quite a weight now. Now we got lucky. Yeah, the Wicked Twister is running now. I don't think I've seen this thing run in the last few years, the times I've been here. We're going to jump on the Wicked Twister because there's not much of a weight. 15 minutes, it didn't even look like it was that, and I haven't ridden this thing in years, like I said, because it's always shut down. Let's go ahead and jump on it. Well, you say that's one of your favorites, the Wicked Twister, and you haven't ridden it in a really long time. Was it worth it? Yes. Really? It's a short wait. I would do it again if yeah. you weren't oh, so I'm not happy with it. Again. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, seagull! <laughs> you gotta dodge the seagulls over here, they poo on your head a lot. <laughs> it's gross. So. Well, I'm glad you got to, you enjoyed it. Yes, I did. We rarely ever, it's rarely ever running. Yeah, I don't know why. I mean, maybe there's problems with it. But. Yeah, or because it breaks people's ankles on launch. Mine are fun. Yeah, I, I couldn't believe that, dude. <laughs> it launched, my leg shot back, crack. I was like, son of a... <laughs> I think you're the only one complaining, dear. Yeah, so your tummy holding up. Good. So we can Good. ride more? Yes. All right, let's go find something. Okay. They got the wall down now for where the that aquarium slash aqua show thing used to be. And it looks like it's just a stage. It looks nice, but it's just a stage. So I wonder if that's their permanent plan or if they're gonna be doing something else here. Got a great pumpkin fest advertisement. That's gonna be in two short weeks. Oddly though, I haven't seen any decorations out yet. I've seen some of the facades in front of the haunts. It's not very busy back here at all today in Planet Snoopy. Oh, the peanuts are out. Let's go get a look at the peanuts game. We got Lucy and Linus out. Yay. So, it's not, they usually have the peanuts out, but it's hit or miss for when they're going to be out in Planet Snoopy. But yeah, I mean, it's not very crowded back here at all today. I love riding Snoopy rides, but... Oh, yeah, but I don't have my little guy, so they won't let me on any of the rides. <laughs> Lindsay's just now seeing that uh, Joe Cool's Cafe's gone. All the memories we had eaten here over the years. And instead, it's been replaced by this, Mel Bar and Grill. So you don't think that's as good, Lindsay? You don't want to get a, a bone sandwich? No. It looks good, right? Even a fancy grilled cheese doesn't sound better than Joe Yeah, Cool's. that bone sandwich has some cheese on there. So it's a grilled cheese and bone. It's a crunchy grilled cheese. Ugh. I don't know who Boris It's Fendi. Is Lindsay says, uh, Lindsay says, Jay, our little guy loves Bendy. I don't even know what Bendy is, but I'll pretend to be excited. Hey, it's Bendy, dude. Oh, so we got the food trucks are up here in the midway. So, I'm going to wait a little while to eat. But I wanted to get a look at them. It's also congested right here. They got a little booth here next to the food trucks where you can vote for your favorite one. Well, that's cool. All right, Lindsay has demanded that we get food now and later, so that's what we're gonna try to do. I'm looking for barbecue. Barbecue's my favorite. He's sketching the Invisible Man. So the first food truck we're gonna hit up today is this one. It's called SWAT. Lindsay and I, we're just gonna split a burger. Neither one of us are real hungry yet. There we go, the Mexican burger from the SWAT food truck. It's got jalapenos on it, I believe, right? It said something about chorizo sausage. Yeah. I like chorizo sausage, so I'm excited. Lindsay says this is the only spicy thing I'm allowed to get today, because we're sharing. A bunch of stuff fell out of it on my hand and burned my hand. It's good. Is it 
too spicy? No, not really. I mean, I don't find it spicy. It's got cream cheese on it, too. Ooh. So, here, give it a try. Ah, uh, just bite into it. It's not like your mouth's never touched oh mine. Oh my gosh! It's a little messy. This is worse than a whopper. <laughs> he would want everything. No way! I have a street! And I didn't even know it. Nobody I wants to live was. there. Mm -hmm. so they want one of these cups. Maybe I'll surprise Jared with a little pig pen keychain. Think I should? <laughs> oh no! Careful Snoopy Boy Scouts! That looks treacherous. 
Make sure we ride the Gemini every time we come here. And today's gonna be no exception. We're gonna ride it. But look, it's its 40th birthday. What colors are we gonna be? Red or blue? Blue. Blue. We're going for blue. Well, blue one, dear. Yes. At the cost of almost breaking my back on the final stop, though. <laughs> that was rough. Yeah. No. But hey, we did it. We Swung won. us around a bit. Yeah. I love riding the Gemini. Hope yeah, I never take it down. Look like you found a place to sit in the shade for a while. Is it a pretty comfy little bench? No. No? Oh, okay. But it's comfy enough. <laughs> comfy enough. Just be aware that if you're going to ride the Steel Vengeance, they do have a strict no cell phone policy in place now. This wasn't here earlier in the year, but I think they had some issues with some cell phones flying out of pockets. And they will not let you in the line if they see you with a cell phone. So be aware. There's some lockers right next to it. You can just you know, stash your stuff in there. No, uh, no they don't have any boxes and they're very strict about it. They're throwing people out of line and everything if you have a cell phone, so don't risk it. Just put your phone up, dude. You don't need yeah. it anyway. No. It's time for round two of the battle for the food trucks. And this time it's Lindsay's choice. Was Lindsay's that? choice was in pandas, and pandas, Empanada. empanadas, and more. And she got a Philly cheesesteak empanada. Yep. Let's go sit down and try it. Never had a plantain before. And there we go. What's it called again? Empanada. Empanada. And then uh. Philly. Got two sauces, cilantro and sweet and tangy. And then he gave you a free plantain to try. Yeah. See if you liked it. Looks like a banana. It's Try it, what do you think? It's a banana, it's supposed to be like a vegetable banana. Try it. What do you think? Tastes like a banana? You don't yes. Like I don't like it. Oh no, would you like bananas? I don't like that one. Oh, bummer. Plantains is bland. So we had to come over here into the shade to eat our empanada. Is that how you say it? Empanada? Yeah, it's not. It's weird because it's not a real hot day, but if you're in the sun for more than a little bit, it is yeah. kind of <laughs> uncomfortable. But what'd you think? Yeah. I really liked it. I picked the cheesesteak and it had peppers and onions in it, and I love peppers and onions. But you and did it was not. so gooey. It was like pizza cheese gooey. Yeah. <laughs> but you didn't like the plantain. No. Yeah, I liked no, that it. Was gross. I liked whatever it was. Empanita. Empanada. I liked it too. Uh, we shared yes. one. It was small, but you know what? We, I don't know. Neither of us it's really need much food right now. It's yeah. better when you Because then yep. you can try more. We're going to try at least one more thing today. I think. At least one more. At we're we're going to try, hopefully, Cupzilla? Yeah. About to watch the Snake River fall go down. Yeah. For a huge splash. One single guy! Look at that! He's all by himself. And boom! <laughs> Buddy, where's your friends? I love how when sometimes you're entering the Frontier Trail, you can just smell nothing but gunpowder. I like it. It adds to the ambience back here. I, they, I don't ever hear them firing anything off, though. But, I mean, they must. I must just always miss it. Oh, is that what it's from? The muskets on the train ride? Oh, okay. It looks like you found another little comfy chair. Is this one comfier than the bench? And it rocks! Yeah, we're back. We're checking out the animals now. What's your uh, little friend there, Lindsay? What is that? Is that a llama? It's either a llama or an alpaca. I don't know the difference. Uh, me neither. I'm not very good at recognizing what the animals are. <laughs> it likes you, though. I like him, too. Apparently, they have a hard time keeping the little birds in their pens because this dude's just out free running. Yeah, they have a mass bird escape going on over there. <laughs> Oh, we got some goats back here. That dude, I don't know if his horn just didn't grow all the way or if it got broke off. I'm not sure. Not sure how that works. That turkey escaped, but I mean, what do they expect? That rope doesn't look like it's gonna keep anything in. That looks like a cross between a swan and a rooster. Oh, look at it, you got some swans. Now those are regular swans. I don't know what those things are. Those uh, rooster ducks, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they're duckins. <laughs> says, take a trade or selfie with Samson the camel. If this is Samson, he doesn't look like he wants any part of your selfies. It's a yak! It's two yaks. I think that, that guy back there looks like he's mad that I'm filming, so I'm gonna slowly back away from the yaks and go somewhere else. 
They got a couple goats right here. These guys are pygmy goats. And then these goats are a type of goat that I don't know how to say the word, so I'm not going to try. They're that. This dude is super active. He's been just trucking around this enclosure for the last 10-15 minutes. Oh, look at that. He didn't even care that dude touched me. I mean, you're finding all the chairs, aren't you? <laughs> I see. This one's slightly different. What's that? More chairs, huh? <laughs> Found more <Yes>. chairs. <laughs> yeah, we're in the Frontier Trail. Tavern, Frontier Tavern. I like to come back here and sit. That's what we're gonna do. Lindsay has demanded all fun stop until she gets back to the food trucks. That's but I did, I, I did talk her into letting me sit in here and have a beer. It's a magic hat. Some, I don't know. I asked for a nail. I think that's what this is. It's a magic hat. That is really weird. It's good. She said it was vegetable-y and fruity, and it does kind of smell vegetable-y. But it has a taste. I've never tasted anything like this before. Are you dancing? Yep. Yeah. Having a good time in the Frontier Tavern. I love sitting in here. I don't think I've ever been in this part of it. Just up to the bar. And back out. Well, we usually have kids that wouldn't sit still. That's true, too. So I was thinking, well, we go to amusement parks a lot, like a lot, a lot. This is the first time in 16 years, 17 years, we've been just the two of us in a park without the kids. It's like an amusement park date. Yeah. <laughs> it's great. Yeah. How's that beer? Yeah, vegetable beer. We just got done right. <laughs> you okay? We just got done riding the Iron Dragon, but they were doing like a virtual reality thing with it, where they stick these virtual reality glasses and it plays a, I don't know, plays some sort of scene out. A medieval scene. Yeah, like you're going through a castle and a dragon's carrying you through the mountains. It was with, a giant bat carrying with, you. Oh, giant bat. I don't know, it had dragons. Yeah. So it was quite a wait. What'd you think? You got sick. I, yeah. I'm... She's done. I don't even know if we're gonna get the free and barbecue now. <laughs> Lindsay, you found another seat. It is, isn't it? This is yeah. like a throne. Yeah, you better get off it though. Come on. <laughs> the final food truck choice of the night is Cupzilla. It's Korean barbecue. We got a combo with pot stickers, but I don't see them. Where are the pot stickers? Oh, they, you put, they put them in the... Yeah. It looks like a lot of food. Yeah. Look at that. So we got beef. Huge. Uh, number three, spicy. One yep. on a scale of one to five. Let's go find some place to sit and try it. Oh, I yeah. smell the spice. We just finished up our cupzilla beef cup. What'd you think? It was good. It was I really like the pot sticker was my favorite. Yeah, we did. We got a combo. So we got one pot sticker. Pot sticker? Is that what they're called? Yeah, it was mandu. But it said pot sticker underneath. I don't know. It, it was, was good. So it tasted like an egg roll, but... Really good. Really, yeah. really good. So I think that's all we're gonna do. It's three food trucks. Yeah, I can't get all my food. Yeah, what sure what are you voting for? Are you not gonna disclose that information? I'm gonna vote for the empanada. Empanadas? Okay. I haven't decided. Well, actually I think I'm gonna do Cubzilla. I really like that Mexican burger though. Yeah. I like the empanadas as well, but Yeah. I think the the Korean barbecue is gonna get my vote tonight. Last time I was here, they had a bunch of pig pen. So either Cedar Point was like, whoa, 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 get the pig pens out of here. Or he was a super popular item and everybody bought him up. And in case you're wondering, they still don't have any pig pen bugs. I do now. It's broken, but I have one. I don't remember his name, but do you think it bothers him that Linus has got his blanket thrown on his face? Okay, his name's Franklin, that's who it is. Now, I don't know many of the Peanuts names. I barely knew that was Linus. That's gonna do it for us today, Cedar Point, the food truck battle. So we ate some great food truck food. Rode some rides, not all the ones that we wanted to. The lines were pretty long. Even though the park wasn't like overly crowded, it's just like four or five of the coasters had exceptionally long lines. Uh, we got to do a VR coaster for the first time and Lindsay got sick. Thanks for watching.